Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy Nahid, back to watch more Baruto, Naruto, Next Generations. Here to watch episode 18. I did skip the first two, I mean, the ones before that, because you know, they send it fillers on the internet, so I was like, fuck it. Moving on and just continuing on with the stuff that is important to see, I guess. You know, even though they've probably been fun, but hey, we're going to just keep moving on with it. Just want to thank you all for watching with me. I really, really do appreciate it. You guys know all the announcements. Comment, like, subscribe, and both notifications. Uncut early access on Patreon, YouTube memberships. Thank you all for being here. I appreciate it. Let's get this show on the road. Oh, someone's sick. Himawari is sick. Got AC in the house and everything, bruh. I'm gonna go now. I have to go get her medicine for her. Would you keep an eye on Imawari for me? No problem. Of course he is. We had a rough time with Himawari back then, too. It is getting late. Where's Monica? Oh, wow. There you go. He's sick, too. Oh, never mind. Oh, okay, never mind. And all of us will be there. All of his friends will cheer him on at full power. Well, if you ask me, it's obvious I gave up my seat so he could be. Yeah. Sensei, I promise I'll become. Oh, he's just thinking about the past. Okay. Where is he? I don't know. He's hung over. It's not in the past. I'm just being stupid. Sadly, it's not. Apparently, the artisan who's doing the embroidery is very picky. Okay. Oh, yeah. yeah this is going to be perfect. It wasn't finished in time for Kakashi Sensei's inauguration. Man, how old is this lady by now? So this means I'm finally being relieved of my duties. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life relaxing at a hot spring. Oh man, it's gonna be a drag if you leave a bunch of work for us to do. We're definitely gonna need you to stay on as a trusted advisor. We picked up smoking. Smoking's not allowed here, sir. <laughs> can't smoke anywhere these days. Yeah. In any case, he's, he's right. Hey, come on, you two. Hurry, let's go. What are you guys doing? <laughs> hey, they're gonna rip it. Oh man, parents, parental, it's. I'm sure the headache is fucking crazy for the guy. Oh, Byakugan. Byakugan? What the heck's going on? Exactly. Oh, she's coming. Oh, dude, that even got Kuruma. <laughs> she's strong. He will worry. The sixth Hokage will be the one presiding over the ceremony today. Where the fuck is he? All right then, let's bring up the man of the hour himself, the hero of the ninja world who guided us after the great ninja war. The man who will succeed me as the seventh Hokage. Did he do a sub? Uzumaki. 
Did they just replace him, like, with uh, Kanahamaru? Damn, he about to meet his ho Mrs. Hope. His whole meeting. This is in the past. I keep toying back and forth with it. Okay, he was thinking about it. Okay, I'm such. I'm so sorry, guys. He's already been Hokage. I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Ever since that day, I can't believe he's not even coming home at a time like this. I'm home. I heard Himawari has a fever. Is she all right? Don't you have to work, Dad? Shikamaru and my shadow clone are still there. Hey, Dad. Your cloak is inside out, you know? He's all got his shit together. You're still so uncool. I mean, I think he's the coolest. Actually, the whole world thinks he's the coolest, dude. We adore Naruto Uzumaki in the anime world. <laughs> oh yeah. If you're going to be loud, then go outside. <laughs> I love this. See what you did? You got mom all upset. No, I didn't. She got upset because of you. <laughs> all right. Well, Himawari seems to be doing better, and I left a pile of unfinished papers at work. So I guess I'll go. Why don't you just hang out with your son? Hey, you want to go get a bite to eat? Huh? You want to go out? I thought you said you would work today. Yeah, I do, but I can't work when I'm hungry. So what do you say we go get something? Smart move, bro. Be a good dad for once. Either ramen or burgers. I've been coming to this place since I was a little kid. I've got a lot of fond memories here. And it used to be such a small little place, but now it's huge. Seriously? I. Uh, Mom says you eat hamburgers every chance you get, and it's the only thing you eat. Is that really true? And if it is, that's a totally unbalanced diet. Mom, you're one to talk, Mr. I. Only ever eat ramen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have no idea how much. Ichiraku has ramen upgraded, okay. I wonder if he still has a free lifetime with the ramen. Yeah, certificate. He still uses it, dude. Who, who? <laughs> There's like a full-on restaurant, dine, fine dining experience. I feel like. It's your rock ramen. Ever since that day, your mother's been in love with this place. Yeah. By the way, how are things at the academy? So so. Don't give your teachers too much trouble now. Although when I was your age, it's Kagemasa. Wow, I didn't know they had this. What? Oh, I didn't know you liked that kind of thing. I didn't say that. <laughs> of course he likes this stuff. All the kids do. Well, he seems to be making more friends. 
So that's good. Oh yeah. That looks delish. You don't need to worry so much. And whose fault is it that I can't just be a happy go lucky kid? Mm. Welcome. Hey, what a coincidence. Oh. Georgie, I didn't know you bring your daughter here. <laughs> you bet. Yeah. Dad and I always come here at least once a month to do our ramen eating contest. You're actually battling your daughter in a ramen eating contest? You stay out of it, Naruto. This is a serious battle for us chubby types. Our pride is on the line here. In this world of extreme calories, parental ties are of absolute I don't quite get it, but they seem to be having fun. Why can't our family be more like that? Because they don't have these special things together, maybe? I don't know. Hell yeah, you do, bro. We all do in a weird way, you know, because we, we saw them, you know, kind of grow up in the shop. Now they're all big, grown, and yeah. <laughs> Oh, snap. Seriously? Yeah. They made Hinata so f fucking phenomenal. I mean, she was always great, but like... I like that. A different dream. Now that I'm a Hokage, the entire village is my family. So I want to protect and cherish every single person. Oh, not a dog. <laughs> I can't believe it. I'm starting to sound exactly like Grandpa Sutter. <laughs> He's already made it. His dream was to be gotcha. That's how it's supposed to be, right? Ah, this shit is motivational, man. At the end of the day, I'll be real with you, man. That shit got me a little bit like I feel real good about that one. Uh, cause you know, I think my favorite thing that is so far is toward, toward the end of it when Naruto realized that he has a new dream now, and. That's amazing, because, like, you know, uh, life changes, man. Things happen, bro, you know what I mean? And, like, you know, you have to, like, kind of, like, roll with the punches and try to figure out what's best for you, yourself, and, you know, whoever you're around, your people that surround you and whatnot. And dreams change, you know? Fam, like, you know, uh, shit, my dream has definitely changed. You know, I, 
growing up, it was a certain way that I felt my life was going to go and become and do and all this other stuff, you know what I mean, you know, whatever. But as I've gotten older, man, and like, you know, life hits you with a lot of curveballs, you know, my the dream that I had originally had has, has definitely changed. It's not what I want anymore, per se, you know, I don't know. I want my dream to be somewhat similar, you know, it, it's like, okay, so my dream has always been like the white picket fence, you know, like, you know, family, house, cars, you know, uh, all that great stuff, you know, uh, but lately, man, you know, that whole concept, that idea of just like that, has, it's, it's slowly dwindled a little bit. I think, I don't know what my calling is, but like, you know, my dream right now is just to, I guess, hang out with you guys and uh, see my dog and cat kind of like live their lives and just see them and hang out with them. It's crazy, you know, it's, uh, I'm kind of living the dream a little bit, not all the way there. I need to get there. I'm still working on it. But, like, you know, when you go through a lot, or you experience a lot in your life, you know what I mean? You start realizing things change. It's not all materialistic. It's not, uh, it's, it's, it's something that you already have sometimes, and you just kind of, kind of got to work on it, you know? Like, Naruto, man, he's, like I said, he's such a role model in a way to me. And I don't know if you, he's a cartoon character, so it's hard to be like, yo, he's my role model. I know I'm like downplaying the fact that he's a cartoon character, but like you know he's he's done so much and he's still held on his own way, his his Nindo way. He says it all the time, you know. Um, it's but and, and 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 as you get older, man, holding on to your ways is like really hard, especially when your ways have been slammed, destroyed, and like just taken for granted. You know what I mean? Um, and and it, as you get older, bro, your spirit. I mean, like for some folks, for me, my spirit definitely had to die, but like. I wish I could still be like the way, the tenacity that he still has, you know what I mean? That he can just still, as many curveballs and many things as life hits him with, he's able to still be himself, you know? And I don't want to try to get to that. I want to, I want to be more of Nahid, you know, because I do enjoy being me. But like lately, I'll be real with your fam. I feel like I've like lost who I am as a human being sometimes, but I'm getting there. I'm getting there, you know what I mean? I appreciate y'all for a lot of giving you, like, listening to this right here. I don't know if people sometimes don't they just watch the reaction. They just kind of skip forward a little bit. But, no, nah, man, Naruto definitely, he's, you know, he, he he's what anybody would want to be. He became the leader of the village. He married the, the girl, the quiet girl that ended up being fucking dank, as I would say. Just dank. Uh, and she's the queen of gluttony. <laughs> But no, hey man, so also, uh, so I realized, by the way, when we were talking about the inauguration, he was looking at the past. It's, I know it took me a little bit to like go back and forth on that. I'm sorry about that shit. But Himawari, man, uh, the Byakugan taking out Naruto just like that, that's kind of insane. It just shows uh, the children that they have uh, fostered, uh, Hinata and uh, Naruto, they're going to be fucking strong, man. Uh, I really enjoyed the dinner there. It was, it was nice to see that to go down and to see, you know. See it, dude. It was nice. It's nice. It's nice, you know. Uh, but yeah, man, good stuff. Good, really, really, really good episode. Uh, I think I'm gonna take a little pause right now and then probably jump back into more of it tomorrow. I'm hoping. Goal is just keep this train moving. I know I took a little bit of a fell off for a little bit, especially on Patreon. I'm sorry about that, guys. But uh, I'm working on myself. I'm trying to get back up there so I can put out the best reactions for y'all. You know. But hey, man, thank you all for watching me. I appreciate you. I love you. Like I always say, please take care of yourself, your families, and see you on the next one. Peace.